Hey everyone, it's me Infinite Designer. Today we are going to create this 3D looking logo intro animation in a light motion. We will create this stunning intro animation by just using some effects of a light motion. So, let's begin. So first of all, set the background to white. Now use vector drawing tool and make this type of straight line. Now remove its color and add a simple stroke. Now open edit points and make this line little curvy by adjusting the handle like this. Now simply duplicate this line layer and move the outer point like this. Adjust the curve by the handle like this. Make some more duplicates and place them as they cover the entire frame like this. Now hide all the layers. Now add a circle layer and make it smaller like this. Now make a gradient. Set the upper color to any bright color that you want and set the lower color to white. Now place this circle layer above the first line layer. Now add an effect called repeat along path on the circle layer. Now first set the start value to 100. Now increase the phase value little bit. Now decrease the end whale to make a particle like this. Now go to range transform and decrease the scale value to make the tail thin. Now decrease the alpha to zero. Now if you zoom in, then you can see that the circles are looking separately. So just increase the count value to make it smooth.
Now come to phase and set it to minus 0.1. Now add keyframes at 0 and 1.15 seconds. Now set the phase to 100 at second keyframe. Make this graph here. Now duplicate this circle layer and place it above the second line layer. Now just change the upper color of the gradient. Now make duplicates of the circle layers for each line layer and add different bright and poppy colors in it. Now select all the layers and make a group. Now duplicate this group and place it at 0.05 seconds. Now open this group and delete some circle and line layers. Now rotate this group like this. Now place it at the middle like this.
Now add your logo. Now add a raster extrude effect on the logo. Now first set the light to flat light. Now come to orientation and set the alpha to 20 and beta to minus 40. Now go to interior and add two light colors like this. Adjust the depth also. Now come to orientation and add keyframes at 0 and 1.15 seconds. Now set the alpha and beta to 0 at first keyframe. Make this graph here. Now go to scale and add similar keyframes. Set the scale value to 0 at first keyframe. Now go to scaling options and add keyframes at 1 and 2.15 seconds. Decrease the size at 2.15 seconds. Make this graph here. Now open raster extrude effect and add keyframes at 1 and 2.15 seconds in rotation. Set the alpha and beta at 20 and minus 40 at 2.15 seconds. Now add similar keyframes in moving options and move the logo little up at 2.15 seconds. Now add your text at 1 seconds. Add a text spacing effect and increase the spacing like this. Now add keyframes at 1 and 2.15 seconds. Now drag the text down at 1 seconds.
at this similar graph here also. Now add similar keyframes in opacity and decrease the opacity to zero at first keyframe. Now to add a continuous zoom out effect, add a null at 2 seconds. Pair the text layer and the logo layer with null. Now go to scaling options and add keyframes at 2 seconds and at the end of the video. Now decrease the size at last keyframe. Here we have added so many effects in the circle layer. Therefore, the video preview is not working properly. But it will be look smoother after export. So now to add a 3D look into this, we have to add the cinematic bars. So for that, add a rectangle. Now duplicate this rectangle and change its color. Now go to edit shape and decrease the Y value. Now select both the rectangle and use the third masking option to make it. Now set the color to black. Now place these bars below every layer. Now the particles add going above the cinematic bars which creates a 3D look. Now simply export the video and see the result. See, our intro animation is looking absolutely smooth and amazing. So that's it for today's video. We have simply created an amazing intro which has a minimal as well as 3D look.